go. Greetings and salutations, everyone. My name is Featherhoof, and welcome back once again to Resident Evil 7, where we played the game. We played the just like seconds after continuation that was Not a Hero. And when Not a Hero released for free, which was awesome, season pass holders actually got another surprise. They got even more post game story content. That story content in the form of End of Zoe. Which is, I always thought she got the shaft in this game. And I thought she was gone. We saw her consciousness inside the mold with Jack. And it was like, what, wait, what do you mean End of Zoe? She's gone. I was like, what does that mean? So I was like, I had, I was like, okay, let's look this up. This weeks after Not a Hero. So again, continuing the story. This is why. Um, I didn't actually play the lot of you know the the band footage, uh, Jack's Fifty Fifth stuff like that because it's not continuing the story. It's either prequel stuff or you know um, just extra things. This stuff I wanted to play on the channel because it's it's more. It's continuing past the ending, and I I want more of this game because this is what. It, for those who have watched my top five of the year video, I don't know if it's out by now or not, but it's coming. If it isn't by now, it's coming soon. You'll know. That this is one of my all time favorite games of this year, of 2017. My apologies. So, we're gonna jump right on in. End of Zoe, weeks after Not a Hero, a new danger has emerged. Jack's brother, Joe, God, it's like my family. My family did that too. All the boys have the same first letter name. <laughs> Jack's brother, Joe Baker, must face this danger with his bare fists and put an end to this family suffering once and for all. No guns? Bare fists? This will be interesting. Hi! Ooh, doesn't this look familiar? Oh! I remember this! There's only one left. I didn't do that! It was foolish to hear I'm sure there's someone who can help. This is my home. So that's what happened if I had gone the other way. I'll send help. I'll send help. Don't bother. There won't be anyone left to help! Oh! See, I, in the game, I didn't choose my wife because I found out she was a operative of the connections. I was like, she lied to me all this time. Screw that lady. No, Evie, please. Okay, that's that still happened like that though, and then she, yep, just like that, and then poof. She went poof! Didn't she go poof? I could have, I could have sworn she went poof. What the hell you boys up to? That's her, all right. Zoe Baker. She's still breathing. Call in an agent. Huh? Do you say uh, Zoe? Sir, do you live here? What the hell's wrong with her? We're Zoe. here to help. So everything. What in God's name have you done? Sir. <laughs> Damn! Stop! Stop! Okay, maybe the bare hands thing isn't gonna be so bad. Oh my goodness, so what the hell do they do to you? Oh, case of misunderstanding. I get that. Is that guy sleeping? Or is that Joe? Is that Joe? Did Joe put on one of their uniforms? Listen to me. I'm here to help. <laughs> Joe don't believe that. I don't believe you, boy. Oh. <laughs> Tell me, what kind of help comes in a helicopter gunship? You don't know what you're talking about. You don't get it. You think I don't know who you people are with all these... Monsters running around here. Yeah, people wouldn't know about Umbrella by now. Tell me, where did they come from? It's not what you think. You don't understand. I don't understand. Uh oh. You see that girl back there? Look. That there, my brother's little girl. My niece. You understand? Oh. Right here, family is a righteous cause. I'm noticing. And you ain't gonna kill my family. I fear for him, I do. But man, he needs to take a chill pill and, and listen. Something I can abide. For fuck's sake, 
she's infected. She's dying. And we're both gonna fucking die if we don't get the fuck out of here right now. Mm. <sighs> she ain't dead yet, boy. So I figure you better do something about it. Boy, I feel you two little friends outside. Okay. He's serious. <laughs> There's a cure. Oh, is there now? You're lying to me. <sighs> I'm not lying. I'm not lying. We were on our way to get her treatment, and you fucked that up when you jumped us. Oops! You're probably still waiting for us right now. <sighs> Where? Can, can can I come too? <laughs> You're gonna leave me in the shed. Oh! Took it to an old shack, and not too far from here. Ooh. Ooh! It's there. I swear. There was no gator I saw. That was no gator I saw today. Was that checking the lies when I saw? When I saw, I had one, so I pulled it up. It said it was some sludge covered God knows what with huge teeth and claws. Trying to get at me, so I punched the fucker's teeth in before he could. Oh my god, I love this dude. Never thought I'd see it with my own eyes. Goddamn government doing secret experiments on people and animals. No doubt about it. Explains those helicopters flying by recently. Okay, so he doesn't know about Umbrella. He, he's, uh, he believes it is the, um... Ooh. Oh! Left mouse button? Right mouse button. Oh god, he's gonna punch everything. So he just believes that it's the government. Okay. Don't fix this, Zoe. You're my family. Oh, poor Zoe. She looks kinda cool though. <laughs> Alright, how, how do I what do I do? Oh, there's a door. Hi door! Don't ask why I didn't see the door. I don't know why I didn't see the door. Can I close it so they don't get caught and die? Apparently not. Joe doesn't believe in closing doors. He says, fuck that noise. Cam fluid. We got in here. Oh, still have my defense coin. He has a lot of space. Good to know. It's a lot of space. Let's give this a little save. Not that we really need to save this, save this close to the beginning, but you know. Left. And a right. I said right. They have punches with lever for fast follow-up jab. Neat. This is gonna be interesting as fuck. Holy shit! I cannot wait to see how this turns out. But we just got this. No, Ethan was an absolute pussy. Ethan was a fucking pussy. I mean, we got Chris who was like. You know, shoots them in the face and then pushes their heads off or kicks them, kicks their torsos out. You know, now we got ja or Joe here who's just like a badass. He's just like, infected mutant types, I just punched him in the face. I don't take kindly to none of that. It's a grub. Tab. Okay. Critters can be combined with Kenfu to create healing items. Eat them as is, also replenishes health. Right, let's see what we got here. Okay, and how, what's the button to combine? F. Neat. So he's a man of the land. He, I like this guy. I think this is going to be the best DLC this game has. i punch this door open. He's like Ken from Fist of the North Star. You're already dead. What was that? Santipede. And what did he get the antique coins too? Alright, you moldy motherfucker. Ha ha ha! Oh! Damn! Screw your leg! Joe Baker is the best character in video game history! Oh my god! <laughs> Excuse me, sir! Prepare to die! Fuck you! Die! Oh, nice! 
nice uppercut! He took out his grundle and it made his head explode. Oh my god! Oh my god! I love this DLC so much I do. What? A door? Break it! Fuck you, door! A boxer effigy. I don't know what that's for. Let's make ourselves a... What was that? What was that? What are you? What was a piece of fence? Another centipede. Alright! We got more chem fluid. Oh, juice survival menu. I didn't even see this. Bodies are tough, but heads are soft. Punch them. <laughs> oh my god! Give it as many fast punches as possible. Left, right, right, with some fast right... Oh, that's what I was doing! Or right, left, right, that a strong left knocks them out. Oh, so there's combos! Heads crush easily underfoot when they fall down. Crouch and sneak up behind them. Ooh. Ooh. He even has sneak attacks. Oh. Capcom, you know, you've done some bad things. You really have. You know, you let us down with Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. You know, you, you, you but you, you're doing some good things, too. You're bringing back Mega Man and Mega Man 11. You're, you made this DLC. Thank you, Capcom. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, auto flashlight. Oh. oh! Okay, so it's either right, left, right, 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 it was right, left, right, left, or left, right, 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 right. Okay. I wish I could go back to the punchy bag and practice a little more. Cure for E-type infection. Ooh, what the... Uh, take it or punch it! One of the two! Jesus Christ. Okay, well, we got to care for the zombie. By the way, I'm gonna punch you. Bro, this was a short DLC. We got the, we got the cure already. All right. Hi! Let you out! Blah. Hey! Be dead! Okay. I hear you out here. Hi! Yes! Boom! Where's that other one? Where's that one we knocked down, but we didn't get to... Hi! No, 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 no! Fuck you, dude! Okay, it's actually a little difficult to get this, the, the timing down for the punches. It's not a matter, don't spam it. If you try spamming it, you're gonna fail. Oh yeah, and don't forget, there is guard. <laughs> For some reason, I always forget that in games. Oh, there was a map button? I forgot that was a map. I didn't use that at all during the Naughty Hero DLC. That might have helped. We're gonna sneak. We're gonna sneak up on a bad guy. We're gonna do the, the stealth kill. Can, can you do stealth kill? Where's the stealth kill? What is that? What is that? Yeah, we're our house is on fire. No, 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 no. Run it, run it, run it. Oh hi. Actually, hold on. Left, right. Hold on. Right, left, right, left. Okay, there's that. There's one coming. I hear it. And there's a left, right, right. Okay. So I got it. I got it. Now let's go save Zoe. 
Hey you, stand, hold tight. I'll get you in a minute. Oh, she's looking more infectimified. How does he know where to inject it? Did, did we do good or did we kill her? God damn it. Why did it work? Okay, it did. You! Answers! Was it? It won't be enough. She needs a full dose to heal completely. Okay, where do we find that? There's more at our base. Okay. Just untie me, and I'll take you there. Please. I I trust him. Oh, no! Get me up! Take us as Take us away! Way to go, Joe. Way to go. Whoa! We found him! Gotta get Zoe out of here. Okay. Come on, Zoe. Come on. You know, I gotta say, her molded form is actually very pretty. Oh! It's fucking Nemesis! Can I punch? I cannot punch while holding the Zoe. This be not good. Oh, is that a crank? No, that was that. Okay, uh, is it fire? No, going the. Oh, we go in the water? That's not good. <laughs> it is. It is some horror movie bullshit. <laughs> like Zoe looks like a, like a character out of a cool anime. It's okay now, Zoe. Almost like a um, what you call them, the Espada from Bleach or something. Oh, oh hi. It's like, I know your face now. I will get you. Uh, my grandpappy built that cabin when I was but a babe with his bare hands. We, my family's been living there ever since, and that, that, that damn government went and blew it up with their monsters and their experiments. He did. He's got a good memory. Oh, great. Now we're in Outlast 2. That's a good question. You know, you, you, you live in a place all your life and suddenly there's a wall there. You gotta wonder if uh, you, you elected the wrong person. Looks like somebody left the lights on. That's good enough for me. <laughs> okay, so what, are we still gonna carry the Zoe? Because we can't defend ourselves if we're carrying the Zoe. He got cute, so she's so cool looking. Don't you worry, Zoe. Just a little further. Okay, so yeah, we're carrying the Zoe. The only button that does anything is actually I was gonna say is shift, but even shift doesn't do jack. You can't run, really? I've carried Cindy and I'm able to run while doing it. She doesn't like me doing that, she's terrified I'll drop her, but um I do it. Okay, how do, okay, there's some I'm not looking at her boobs, I'm trying to see them! Oh, come on. Not now, Gator. I'm trying to see the path. So, um... Try not to think- oh, hi, what is that? It's another one of them thingies! Okay, I'm gonna have to remember that. Alright, if I go through there- Let's see our first game over screen. Can I get this, or is it gonna let me because I'm carrying the Zoe? Oh, I got another one, okay. Another boxer effigy. That's the collectibles, isn't it? Is these boxer effigies. There he is! Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Okay, you'll be safe here. Define safe! Because I don't think this is it. Gator, don't make me punch you! Because that's what I do in this game, is punch! And I'm a pretty good puncher. Let's give that a save. Okay, can I get across this? No, okay, there's nothing. Are you sure there's nothing over there, game? You trying to trick me? Can I get out there? No, okay. 
All right, Gator. Do you want to be punched? I'm good at punching the Gators. Joe Baker's my favorite character ever. Like, I liked Jack Baker. He was fun. I loved Lucas Baker. Um... To a lesser extent, I, a lesser extent, I did like Marguerite, too. But Joe Baker's my... Ooh. Stealth kill. Shh. Yes! Die, motherfucker. I love this game so much. Can I? Can we like? Oh, oh! I want like a like a mod where you can play as Joe Baker during the Ethan story. <laughs> I want to go back to the whole, you know, Resident Evil Seven storyline as Joe. That's what I want. Okay, how do I get over there and hopefully not be seen by Mr. Shambles over there? Yeah, see him? Oh, he's over there. I see him. I see him through the cracks. He's coming over here. Yeah, you can't see me, I hope. Joe, can we hang out sometime? You look like a guy to be so much fun to hang out with. Teach me some hand-to-hand -hand combat, because I'm not good at hand-to-hand -hand combat. I'm a weakling. I'm a nerd. Jock me up, dude. Turn me into a badass like you. Will you be my daddy? <laughs> I'm sorry, Dad. Oh, hi. No! Fuck you! Okay, control to restore some health. Okay, that was unfortunate. I was wondering how this punchy mechanic was going to work on those guys. It didn't work out too well for me. <laughs> how are we doing? Yeah, we have one med kit left. Okay. Oh, that was water. <laughs> it's like, what is that? Oh, it's water. Throwing spear? Excuse me? I'm trying to... Oh, did I not change to the throwing spear? Oh, there we go. Got him! Now we know how we deal with those guys. <laughs> Can we get it back? Nope. That is a one-time use only thing. You use it, you lose it. Good to know. Huh. Okay. Okay. Right, left, right, and a boom! Falcon punch! <laughs> I love it. He literally has a falcon punch. Oh, I'll take the boxer effigy. And we're at a save point. And we're approximately more or less 25 minutes in the, at least recording goes. You know what, guys? Usually they put save points right before a situation's about to happen. So I'm going to end this here, and then we'll start the next episode on some high-octane punching action. Oh, I cannot wait. This is awesome. This is the best DLC ever made of anything. Oh, that's not true. The Citadel DLC of Mass Effect 3 was the best DLC of anything ever. But this is second best. <laughs> oh, I know the Shadow Broker. Layer of the Shadow Broker was also really good too for Mass Effect Two. But this is really high up there in the in the list of the, of really good DLCs. Let me know what the, your your all time favorite DLCs are in the comments below. I want to know because <laughs> this is way high on my list. Oh goodness! So guys, until next time, let me know if you enjoyed this episode with a like, comment, subscribe, share it, or you can click on the annotations for other videos I've done. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.